Well, this man will look to continue Brazil's quite magnificent Paralympic Games so far. Ukraine have 12 gold medals so far. As Ihor Sviatov will look to add to that and make it back to back Paralympic Championships. He'll have plenty of work to do, though. This is the coordination impairment category, the most coordination impaired category of all. Bretta will go in two, Zachary in three, Safranov in four, Zvatiev in five, Sviatov in six, Kalashian in seven, and Bordignon in eight. And they get away with no problems at all. It is the man on the inside, Safranov, the European champion, who gets away quickest of all. Sviatov's trying to chase him down. It's going to be close on the line. It's Safranov who gets it. Sviatov comes in in second. And that is a new world record of 11.39 seconds. Well, I said he didn't get the world record when he won that European gold in Bidigosh back in June. But he's only had to wait a couple of months. And he's taken now the Paralympic championship in the T35 category and he's also taken the world record. Dmitry Safranov he's a double world champion from 2013 and 15. He's never won the Paralympic title. He has now. 11.39 a new world record for Dmitry Safranov of the Russian Paralympic Committee. Well, what a start he got off to. Sviatov slipped slightly, but Safranov did all the work. Well, you saw him just come up out of the block so quickly, and it looked here as though we were going to see a comeback from Sviatov, but just not able to produce the goods in those final few metres. And Safranov finding almost a second wind in those final few strides. Look at the stride length. The Russian, a dive from Sviatov, not enough, but he will still win the silver as it's all about this man with an absolute dominant performance and a huge world record. Lifetime best for second and third as well. There is Safranov with that new world record mark of 11.39. Eos Fiatov, the dethroned champion, 11.47 lifetime best for him. And Artem Kalashian, who had the world record, the 24-year-old, 11.75 takes the bronze. Well, interestingly, the bronze by Kalashian would have been a new record. He actually ran a personal best, like you say, so it just shows the standard of how we are seeing the times absolutely smash. And this is the first final of the night. We're going to see a few more of those records get broken. I come to every para championship I go to, whether it's the Europeans, the Worlds, the Parapans, anything it may be, the Paralympics, and you always see numerous records and you wonder when they may stop perhaps never men's 100 meters t35 the final result dmitry safranov a world record takes the gold sviatov the former champion has to settle for silver and kalashian who had the world record takes bronze